For generations we've gazed at the night sky, building ever better tools to see further. We needed a new window, one above the clouds, beyond the haze. Enter the James Webb Space Telescope. Floating a million miles from Earth, Webb's view is unblocked, its golden mirror open to the universe. It's designed to capture ancient light that's travelled billions of years. Webb is our time machine, letting us see the universe as it was when it was young. With every image, Webb rewrites our understanding of the cosmos. It challenges what we thought we knew and fills us with awe. The telescope's mission is just beginning, and so is our journey. Let's look through this new window together. The universe is filled with vast clouds of gas and dust. Nebulae, the birthplaces of stars and planets. For years, visible light telescopes couldn't see through these cosmic veils. It was like staring into a fog, knowing something was happening inside but unable to see it. Webb changes everything by seeing in infrared. Infrared light passes through dust, revealing what's hidden within. Imagine feeling the warmth of a candle in a smoky room. You can't see the flame, but you sense its heat. Webb's golden mirror collects this faint, ancient heat from the cosmos. Suddenly the fog lifts. Where we once saw darkness, Webb reveals newborn stars and intricate structures inside nebulae. We're witnessing the universe building itself, one star at a time. This is a profound shift. We're not just seeing the results of creation, but the process itself. Each Webb image is a glimpse through time and space, pulling back the cosmic veil. The dark patches in old images are now alive with light and structure. The universe is revealing its hidden architecture. Webb's infrared vision is a new sense, letting us see what was once invisible. We're now witnesses to the birth of stars, the formation of planets, and the unfolding of cosmic history. Every image is a revelation, changing our understanding forever. The secrets of the universe are no longer out of reach. Webb is showing us the cosmos as we've never seen it before. The hidden is now revealed. The universe is alive with creation. Some images become icons none more so than the pillars of creation. Hubble showed us their majestic shapes, but much was hidden by dust. Webb's infrared vision transformed them. The pillars are no longer solid towers, but ghostly veils filled with stars. Hundreds of newborn stars shine through, their red glow marking their youth. The pillars are not tombs, they're cradles of creation. At their tips, bright lava-like regions reveal where massive stars are forming. These young stars shoot out jets, sculpting the pillars from within. It's a dynamic, violent and beautiful process, creation and erosion in cosmic balance. We're watching stars shape their own environment, a battle between birth and destruction. The pillars of creation are not static monuments. They're ever-changing, sculpted by the very stars they create. Webb lets us see this process in stunning detail. We're not just seeing a snapshot. We're witnessing a story unfold. Birth, life and dispersal, all in one cosmic scene. Even the most massive structures are temporary, part of a grand cycle. Webb's images remind us the universe is in constant motion. Creation and destruction are intertwined. The cosmos is alive with change. We are privileged to witness it. The story of the stars continues. One of Webb's greatest goals was to find the first galaxies, the dawn of the cosmos. These galaxies are unimaginably distant, their light stretched into the infrared. Only Webb could see them, and it has succeeded. In a tiny patch of sky, Webb's deep field image revealed thousands of galaxies. Every speck is a galaxy, each with billions of stars. Some are spirals, some are strange shapes, and some are tiny, red smudges, the earliest galaxies. These ancient galaxies are small, chaotic, and clumpy, just as our theories predicted. We're seeing the building blocks of today's grand galaxies. It's like looking at baby pictures of the universe. Webb is providing the earliest snapshots in our cosmic family album. These discoveries confirm much of what we thought, but also raise new questions. Some early galaxies are brighter and more developed than expected. The universe may have formed galaxies faster than we imagined. Each new image is a piece of the puzzle helping us understand our origins. We're listening to whispers from the dawn of time. Webb is revealing the universe's earliest secrets. The story of our cosmic beginnings is coming into focus. The universe's first light is finally within reach. For most of history, 
We knew only our own solar system. Now we've found thousands of exoplanets, but knowing what they're like is another challenge. Most are just shadows or wobbles in starlight, invisible to our eyes. Webb changes that by analyzing starlight filtered through exoplanet atmospheres. When a planet passes in front of its star, some starlight passes through its air. Different gases absorb different colors, leaving chemical fingerprints. Webb is sensitive enough to detect these tiny changes. For the first time, we can know what's in the air of distant worlds. Webb's first exoplanet study, WASP-96b, revealed clear evidence of water vapor, clouds and haze. This landmark discovery proved Webb's power. Now, Webb is turning to smaller, rocky planets, worlds more like Earth. It will search for water, methane, carbon dioxide and possible biosignatures. The search for life is entering a new era. We're moving from counting exoplanets to understanding them. We're learning about their weather, chemistry and potential for life. The possibility of finding life is closer than ever. Webb is opening a new chapter in our search for company in the cosmos. Each discovery brings us closer to answering, are we alone? The universe is full of worlds waiting to be explored. Webb is our guide. The search has only just begun. Space isn't empty. It's filled with a rich soup of chemicals. Webb's infrared eyes detect the signatures of molecules, even in the darkest clouds. In star-forming regions, Webb has found complex organic molecules, carbon-based building blocks of life. Methanol, ethanol, and more complex structures are common. The ingredients for life are not unique to Earth. They're everywhere. New planets are born into chemically rich environments. Life's raw materials may have arrived on Earth from these cosmic clouds. The story of life may have started long before our planet existed. Webb lets us trace this chemical heritage back through time. The cosmos is full of potential for life. The universe is not sterile. It's creative, building complexity over billions of years. Webb is reading the chemical recipe of the cosmos. Each discovery brings us closer to understanding our origins. The universe is alive with possibility. We are just beginning to read its story. Galaxies are not isolated. They collide, merge and reshape each other. The Cartwheel Galaxy is a stunning example, its wagon wheel shape born from a cosmic collision. Hubble saw its outline, but dust hid much of the detail. Webb's infrared vision cuts through the dust, revealing fiery regions of star formation. The outer ring is a shockwave, expanding from the impact and triggering new stars. Webb shows us the sparks of creation, glowing in infrared. Delicate spokes connect the inner and outer rings, filaments of gas and dust reformed after chaos. These structures are the galaxy's skeleton slowly re-emerging. Studying the cartwheel helps us understand how galaxies grow and evolve. The Milky Way has collided before and will again. By watching the cartwheel, we glimpse our own future. Destruction leads to creation on a cosmic scale. The universe is a place of constant change. Galactic collisions are engines of that change. Webb lets us witness the dance of galaxies. The cosmos is painted with fire and light. With every Webb image, our picture of the universe grows richer and more complex. We live on a small planet, orbiting an average star in a galaxy among trillions. It's a humbling perspective, but also a special one. We are made of stardust forged in ancient stars. The water in our oceans may have come from the same clouds Webb now observes. We are the universe made conscious, able to look back and wonder. Science connects us to the stars, the galaxies and the beginning of time. Our curiosity is the universe's way of understanding itself. When we look out, we're also looking in, tracing our own origins. Let's not feel small but connected. We are part of this unfolding story. The universe is not separate from us. We are in it and it is in us. This is the most profound discovery of all. It resonates in our minds and our souls. The cosmos is our home. We belong to the stars. Our journey tonight ends, but Webb's has just begun. It will keep sending us wonders from the edge of time. Each discovery opens new questions and new possibilities. We've seen star birth, distant worlds and the dawn of galaxies. The universe is alive with beauty and potential. Science is a shared human adventure, one that belongs to all of us. Whether scientist or stargazer, you are part of this journey. The search for answers connects us all. Thank you for exploring the cosmos with me. 
The universe is waiting. Keep looking up. If you enjoyed this journey, like and subscribe to Cosmic Discover. Together, we'll unravel the universe's secrets one discovery at a time. The adventure is just beginning.